okay find the find the length of the chord length of the chord intercepted by the circle intercepted by the circle by the circle x square plus y square minus 8x minus 2y minus 8 is equal to 0 on the line on the line x plus y plus 1 is equal to 0. This is the problem. Find the length of the chord intercepted by the circle x square plus y square minus 8 x minus 2 y minus 8 is equal to 0. On the line x plus y plus 1 is equal to 0. That means, if any line intersect the circle at two points, the distance between the two end points of that line which intersect the circle is known as length of the chord. That length of the chord we have to find out in this problem. So, let us have a discussion how to find out the length of the chord. So, unless we visualize the problem that means, we represent the problem we cannot find out. So, that means, we may find out, but that will be difficult. So, better let us draw the figure first. So, now, so this is the circle for example, given circle. Suppose the line passing through the circle at two points say A B. So, now this is known as chord, this length of the chord we have to find out. So, just think how to find out that length of the chord. Okay. In lower classes you might have discussed. For example, if center is known, so if you draw the perpendicular on A B, say D, this will be C D is the perpendicular you join this one. So, what does C A represents? That is R radius of the circle. This will be okay, perpendicular distance will be D. So, this is nothing but a right angle triangle. Since it is a right angle triangle already two sides are known, the third side A D we can find out. We know that D is the midpoint as we know A D is equal to D B. So, A B becomes 2 times A D. That means, here just we have to find out A D itself only with the help of R and D values. Now, here 3 values we have to find out. First center from the given circle, radius we have to find out. That means, center and radius of the given circle we have to find out. D, how to find out D? D is nothing but perpendicular distance from center to the given line. Then after that applying Pythagoras theorem we get A D value. So, how to find out length of A B? So, length of A B is equal to 2 times A D. So, that will be the length of the chord very simple. So, first step is to find out center and radius of the given circle. Second step is the perpendicular distance from center to the given line. Next step is the length of the chord is equal to 2 times A D that is all. Okay. Equation of the circle, the circle is x square plus y square minus 8 x minus 2 y minus 8 is equal to 0. Here, 2 g is equal to minus 8, 2 f is equal to minus 2, c is equal to minus 8. Now, g becomes minus 4, f becomes minus 1. 
So, center C is equal to minus G comma minus F. You should be very careful. This will be 4 comma 1. So, now I am writing here 4 comma 1. C is non, center is non. Okay. Now, radius. Radius is given by root of G square plus F square minus C. Am I correct? So, now this will be 16 plus f square means 1 plus 8. This is root 25 that is 5 units, radius is 5 units. That means R value is known. Now, D, D is equal to length of the perpendicular, length of the perpendicular from C 4 comma 1 to the line x plus y plus 1 is equal to 0. In intermediate first year you have studied, what is the formula to find out length of the perpendicular? Drawn from x 1 comma y 1 to the a x plus b y plus c is equal to 0. Could you recall it? That is mod a x 1 plus b y 1 plus c divided by root of a square plus b square. Am I correct? You might have recollected that formula. Okay. This is equal to we can write like this mod of 4 plus 1 plus 1 by root of a square a means 1 b means 1 1 square 1 plus 1 that is 6 divided by root 2. Just if you rationalize with root 2. 6 root 2 by 2, this will be 3 root 2 units. Now, we know R value and D value. From triangle ACD, we know that AC square is equal to A D square plus D C square. So, A C square means R square, A D square plus D square, D C square. So, A D is equal to root of R square minus D square, R square minus D square. R value is 5 that is root of 25 minus D square means 18, 25 minus 18. See, let us check. This is 57, you will be getting. This will be, okay, 7 itself only. So, now length of the card. Length of the card, already we had the discussion. A B is equal to, length of the card A B is equal to 2 times A D that means 2 into root 7, 2 root 7 units, 2 root 7 units. Okay. Check it, have you followed any doubt? So, if you have any doubt better post in your comments. So, our subject expert definitely will attend your queries.